Hey guys, Zach King here with another Final Cut Pro tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to go over how, what to do when you have these, these gaps in your timeline. As you can see, I have a couple gaps between my clips all in this, in this video project. And there's a couple ways to get rid of these. First of all, you can hold down Shift-G, which takes you to the nearest gap to the right of where your playhead is. So if I continue holding Shift-G, it'll move me around to the nearest gap. If you hold Option-G, it takes you to the left, nearest left gap. So that's pretty handy. Now, if when you get to a gap using that command, or you can also just click, click there, you can delete it. So I'm going to go to the right over here by holding Shift-G, and I want to delete it. That's pretty easy. All you have to do is uh, hold Control-G, and it'll shut that space. I'm going to move over to the right using Option-G and delete that space. Or you can also treat the gaps in your timeline like clips and just select them and press the delete key. And eventually you'll get to a problem where you have a gap here, but you have either another video track above or audio track below, and you're trying to delete this gap. And if you see if I click that, there's a little sign that says operation not allowed. Well, you can get rid of that by simply using a T button, which is a track forward, and it selects everything forward of your mouse. So if you press T, a little arrow pops up. I'm going to select this clip, and it selects everything um, to the right of that. And I can drag it where I like it, and it'll snap there. Um, and by the way, if your snap doesn't work, you can uh, press N, and that makes it from snapping or free flowing. So that's uh, a little tutorial on gaps, and I hope that helps you um, edit in your timeline better.